What's poppin' peeps? My name is Micah Samanti and we're back to the another chapter of our lives. Spring 2007. You're entirely bonkers, but I'll tell you a secret. All the best people are Eveline's face nook. Barsha, I guess that's the new thing. So when we last left off, we found some interesting issues where Emily does not want to talk to me. But the other girl, Eve, does. So let's... And we were going to hang out with her. So let's see where Chapter 4 brings us today. April 22nd, a Sunday. Senior year. Ooh. Streaming slow. And streaming blockbuster by mail. Oh my god, I remember when that was a thing. Oh, we got Linkin Park minutes to midnight. Pie. I don't remember that one. Chocolate rain. Oh my god. Yes. Soldier Boy. The Boondocks. Rihanna. Um. You know what's funny? I have a hard time picking these out more than the decisions I have. But I'm gonna go with <laughs> T Pain Arc. Okay, definitely Linkin Park. Don't hate me for that. Spider Man. That's right, because the movie, that terrible, shitty movie, Spider Man 3, then it, got, it had its good moments, but it wasn't better than 2. Just saying. With great power comes great responsibilities. We all have scars. Oh. Arctic Monkey. Let's see what M. You used to get into your fish decks. Arctic Monkey's cut hold of pressure. Blah, blah, blah. Whatever. Hey, best friend. Nine Inch Nails. Oh! Linking Park 2. With a handheld high to the sky so blue, the ocean opens up to swallow you. Mike, best friend. Oh, snap. So it's getting pretty official between me and Eve. So. Yo, yo, yo. What's popping? My homie G. Oh, she even changed to the same color I have almost. I just like have this gopher from that when like this old YouTube video. It's like the meme of the year. I know we already chill today, but I miss ya. I miss you too. Sounds like literally this girl I used to talk to all the time, like every single thing about it. We, like, she would say the craziest things. With The conversations I feel like I'm having with this character are the same conversations I used to have with this particular friend. But we're not friends anymore. You know, people drift apart after time goes on and people change. But it is what it is. It's part of life. So, what are you up to today? Nothing. Homework. Talking to people. Just talking to you. Uh, I wish I could say playing games. That's pretty funny. Nothing. You. Well, I should work on this writing project due tomorrow. Are you just starting it? What's the project? Due tomorrow? What's the project? We have to write a poem about something. Good luck with that. <laughs> poems? I'm an artiste. I get poems all day. You can do it. Is there a prompt? So Emily's not even online. Yeah, but it's super vague. What should I write about? Me, obviously. Some deep shit. <laughs> let's let's be real. Some deep fucking shit. Get so deep in that. I think I could do that. I really like this class. That's swell. That, that word swell. I'm gonna start saying that all the time now. I don't think so. I don't, I don't know anyone. But some of the people in it are pretty cool. Not as cool as me. Well, duh. Oh, yo, guess what? Chicken butt. The sky is what I really would have said. I've been trying to get into hip hop because it's your favorite. Oh! And I found a song that's like halfway there. Awesome sauce! 
Is it T-Pain? <laughs> no, don't tell me it's Soldier Boy. It's probably Soldier Boy. I'm gonna click on it. It's probably Soldier Boy. Oh, that's right. I have to open up Chrome with this. That kind of sucks. But it makes it more interesting. You can tell they worked really hard on that. I, especially the story in this. You can tell they worked really hard in the story in this so far. Like, I'm I'm really intrigued of where this is going. Oh, it's re- Umbrella. So, <laughs> basically what it was, was the pop-punk version of Rihanna's Umbrella. At least you tried. You're best. I actually have that song on my iPod. Funny enough. Oh man, Jackie's blowing up my phone right now. What about? About what? What's going on? Let's yeah, let's let's see. Uh-oh. What's going on? Oh nothing. She's trying to plan a big party. When is it? And the question is should I be invited to this party? Same night as prom. It's an anti-prom party. That sounds like fu Oh, speaking of prom. <laughs> let's, let's pull the bat. That sounds... Oh, cool. Sounds like a lot of fun. Yeah, I don't know if I want to go, though. S so, speaking of prom, I don't know if I want to answer that question. I'm not going to ask that question. Oh, really? Why not? I don't know, it's just the same night as prom. What would you want to do? Skip the prom shit. Go to prom, but do something else instead. Why not? We're let's let's do something else instead. Let's not. Want to skip prom together and do something else instead? Like watch a movie? Skip it together, like as in a date? I don't know. If that's cool with you, I guess so. I don't even know how to respond. Sure, if that's cool with you. Yes, of course, Mike. I was hoping you were gonna ask me in the not in the way I was expecting to ask. Taking my time. Just glad you said yes. You, you could have been the man and asked me. I'm just glad you said yes. Like, I would have said no. But, what's going on with Emily? She has not been on my thing. Jesus, that's the stupidest smile rat now. You're not alone. Smiley face. But where is Emily? Like, why isn't she not online? And why aren't we talking still? What happened between the time span between January and April between our relationship? And I'm really curious about that. Like, I want us to be a thing for so long. Really? Yeah, I know. <laughs> hey, me too. Now we are. Let's go. Yeah, now we are. Can I, like, call myself your girlfriend? Are we really doing the computer girlfriend thing? Are we really in that time period? If you want to, that is not allowed. That's a no, no. No, but I can. Uh, if you want to, sure. Why not? Do you like want to? Yes, I do. Ooh. Oh, Emily is online. Excapade. I mean, excapade. I'm jazz too. Too cool for prom. I'm really jazz for it too. We could definitely have way more fun just us. Proms are so mainstream. Oh, like, who does proms anymore? So, what should we do on our date? Amusement park, the movies, or the beach. I hate the beach, and 
the amusement park or the movies. Depends if it had a bigger description of an amusement park. The movies, I'm always down for movies. I'm a movie fanatic. And just because I am a movie fanatic, I'm gonna go with movies. And honestly, if it was a real first date, that's probably the thing I would say. Just because I love watching movies. So I can't even write to her, nor she hasn't write to me. A little offended. What do you want to see? Horror. Because she likes horror movies. Yeah, a good listener. Doing the right thing. They are. Yeah, that sounds like a good plan. What should we do after? Jackie's party. Drive around. Just, just go nuts. Waste some gas. That sounds sweet. Where do we go? Anywhere you want. The world's your oyster. So you're gonna be like that, Emily? Hey, do you mind if I bring up something semi-serious? I'm always being serious. Oh. I would say why so serious, but that movie doesn't come out till 2008. So that could be in chapter 5, hopefully. So, of course I don't. I wanted to thank you for helping me with the Steve drama this winter. You're really not gonna sign on and talk to me, Emily? Well, fuck you then. I just really wanna know why why that pissed her off so much about not responding. I just wanted to thank you for helping me with Steve drama this winter. I really needed you, and you were there for me. It was nothing. I'll always be here, girl. I know, but really. I can't get the fact my, like, icon's a gopher. <laughs> Your advice to contact Steve's GF and tell me my friends the truth was incredible. What did Steve's GF say? Did your friends believe- Let's go with the- ask the girlfriend what she say. <laughs> she believed me like right away. Good. Good. He deserves it. I mean the kid's a predictable asshole. But enough about that. I just wanted to say it meant a lot to me. It was n You mean a lot to me. So maybe I can at least get some what of a happy ending. It's just so nice you're knowing you're real. I'm the realist. And that you're still around even though you're you know the real me and I know the real you. But do you really know the real me? Do you? Of course, I will always be there for you. You're there for me too. Of course I'm around. <laughs> It's funny, I can't even talk to Emily. You know, it's stupid. I used to think we were incompatible. For reasons like we have different plans for our lives. Hmm. But it's really actions that matter, not stupid stuff like that. Couldn't send it any better myself. Hell, different can even be better. They do say opposites attract. I'm pretty happy too. Oh, shush you. I should have said that. Kells Bells. Hey, check it out. I just finished writing my project. Accept file. And it's right here. I have a poem project. Is this deep enough for you? So, this is not going to pull up and you guys are not going to see it, unfortunately, and I'm sorry about that, so I'm going to read it to you. So, this is what the character Eve said to me. <clears throat> Let me get my uh, poem reading lips going. The sun. It envelopes me whole. While surrounding my soul, and I cannot wade out. The moon. It shines through the blinds. 
reminds me of times when I can't see out. The stars stuck in the so uh, sky. Sky telling a lie that I can't figure out. Beautiful. Snaps. This is really deep. Doesn't try to. Don't try who hard. I kind of just made it up as I went. That was my last bit of homework. Now I can go to bed. And leave me? I know it's the saddest thing. Not like we have cell phones and we can text. I just can't wait to get this super comfy and warm under some covers. I want to join. That does sound. I want to be warm. I want to be comfy and warm. I wish we could cuddle. Oh. And make out. No. I'm not going to say that. I wish we could too. We're the best cuddlers. Oh, so we have cuddled before. Okay. Well, you get some in the long time when we skip prom. That's a guaranteed. Winky face. Sleep tight. Oh, no hearts? <laughs> Good night. Bye. Be sassy about it. I have the same thing. Emily just messaged me. Let's see what she said. Hi. Hello. Let's cut off cap. Oh. She doesn't like being called M. You know we haven't talked in like a while. No worries. Things have been busy. No worries. Can we talk for like a little bit? Of course. Because I need to know the juicy, t juicy deeds of what happened. I just want to say some stuff about January. I'm listening. I'm all ears. I'm really sorry for getting mad at you. Damn right you should be sorry for getting mad at me for not replying for two seconds. But then again, we don't know what happened in the middle of the month, so I can't say anything. But... Oh, shit. Did I hit the... Oh, fuck. Oh, I hit the wrong thing. Did I hit the wrong... Because I wanted to say I'm sorry, but... Alright, whatever. It's okay. It's in the past now. <laughs> I know you didn't, like, own me or anything. Just thought you'd be there for me. I don't know. I just couldn't be. What? I should have been. For the two seconds, you could have waited for me to respond. I could have been there for you. But you decided to be upset and not wait the two seconds. Thanks for saying that. Whew. At least we're getting on good terms. You were taking so long to respond. Two seconds. I wasn't doing anything. Just stuff on the computer. I wasn't. I really wasn't doing anything. Okay, I was just worried you like didn't didn't want to deal with me or something. Definitely not the case. Oh, but now that I'm with Ave, Eva, Ava, I wonder what, and we're going on a date apparently, what does this mean for me and M? Hmm, I guess maybe I unloaded too much back to like all at once. No way, not at all. We were just talking, I didn't feel like overwhelmed. 
Thank you for saying that, I just feel so embarrassed for it. You should be. Like, whenever we talked, you were always so composed. Really? And I was here just being a complete mess. Don't beat yourself up. I could be shit, too. I called her Emily. Thank you so much for talking to me, Mike. Don't mention it. So I guess we're officially talking again. It's Facebook official. I'm glad it's been a while. How's life going? We gotta know the deets of what happened. It's cool beans. Hey, I say that. Me and Jeff finally broke up like a month ago. Thank God. And yeah, it's been really nice being single. Anyone new? Oh, definitely not. Well, that makes sense. College is coming up soon. A fresh start. That's the plan. I have met some new friends, though. Hey, that's part of a fresh start. One of them I think you know pretty well. Oh, really? No. Psh. What? Who is it? Oh, no. <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> this is awkward now. <laughs> By the way. <laughs> actually, girlfriend now. Why the quotes? Yeah, she is grand. Let's let's not bring up the girlfriend. She'll find out in person. She's in my writing class this month. She just sat to me next to me one day. Jeff's in that class too, so it was really nice of her. That sound that really was. Isn't she the best? Oh wait, I shouldn't have said that. She is! Okay, good. Oof. She's like really pretty too. I'm lucky. I know! Oh, so are you. Oh. Uh, okay. It's like I don't want to come off as me. I, I'm going to be like, I know! Yeah, totally. She's gorge. <laughs> well, I'm glad you're doing well. I'm really glad we're messaging again. I'm really glad too. Well, good. <clears throat> Sorry if this isn't getting snappy. Loser. Oh, sappy. I thought it said snappy. Not too bad. Could be sappier. I'm trying to make this a happy story as I possibly can. Challenge accepted. If only you had the memes. Honestly, I really miss talking to you. I miss it too. I think what I missed most was just talking about nothing, if that makes sense. No sense at all. Yeah, I get it. I did the silly face. You're so smart. You know you're just lying. I know. No, you so smart. Ha. Ha. Yeah, I missed this. Ain't going nowhere. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa. Did not mean to mean it like that. Whoa. Fuck. Did not mean to sound like a dick. That sounded like a total dick. Wow. Yeah, I'm sorry. I guess. Sure thing. Let's let's be. Oh, sure thing, Emily. Thank you. Fuck. I totally just fucked up this friendship already. Well, I don't want to steal your whole night, so I think I'm gonna go. 
Are you sure? I don't mind. You can still talk. It's okay, I have homework to do anyways. Thanks for talking to me though, it means a lot. Don't mention it. I totally fucked this friendship up. It's gone. She's gone. Deuces. Peace. D is for delightful. Fuck me. Fuck. I totally just messed this friendship up now. Alright. So we're in summer 2007, guys. We're heading to college. Life is gonna get too real for us. And we're gonna see that in the next video. Hit that subscribe button for some more Emily's Away 2 updates. And as always, thanks for watching.